Sona plays man-to-man -man mostly, but they rotate really, really well and can anticipate passes. Texas may have some wrinkles on defense as well. Texas starts this game the last two possessions in man-to-man. -man. I think they're going to give McDonald that, but probably need to just gather herself and go up strong. So Texas has started 0 for 5. The Wildcats 2 for 4 prior to that. Talk about Texas defensive game plan. Some of those shots and looks that they're giving for McDonald. And into the heart of the defense, another Texas turnover. McDonald will pull up, and good. So very NIT champs defeating Northwestern at home with a pack. Right into the hands of McDonald. Will pull up on the break. But for Arizona, four minutes and 39 seconds. McDonald will try to change that. Great. Step back three. Getting the ball on the floor and getting around before the double team can come. McDonald pushing quickly off the make. And if you remember at South Florida in the fourth quarter, Higgs had nine points. Wow, shot out of a rock. Seven. Both of those players currently not on the floor, though, for the long ones. McDonald simplified. Arizona leads at 15. That's been right about where it's hovered around, and they have had no answer. Hard with the left for those layups, as she does right there. Yeah, just too late. Down finally working to the right. So it pulls up. Active defense. Sam Thomas had room, went to the left. No good, but got the O board. McDonald for three. Makes you pay. It will not show the importance of that play by Sam Thomas. She kept it alive, which allowed Eric McDonald to make the shot. And then the takeaway. Bit thrown to the floor, and the fans at Poly Pavilion up. McDonald, though, likes a very McDonald, but it's good to see her take it over in the second, the second half. They, they, you know, have four players in that game, double figure scoring. Eric McDonald, long ball, conversation. Their Beavers. They've done a great job there. Yeah, and Scott Will talked with us quite a bit before practice or at practice today. Here and give back, and it pays dividends. Ari McDonald. And I, you know, they haven't had a second opportunity here on offense. You know, there, there you go, Ari McDonald. And Ari McDonald, to your point, didn't take it. She had room, it seemed like. Able to take it all the way to the rack. Hands ready this time. <laughs> McDonald. <laughs> Kay Reese looks up. Ari McDonald from distance. So I would anticipate they're going to allow them to play. Airy, quick catch and shoot. Definitely composure, and she wanted that ball. Again, these are 50-50 balls. Going at it. Incredibly from her freshman year. Her mom actually played ball at Long Beach State. Again. Here's here for the Wildcats. Shot clock is at five. Airy. Well, that's a big improvement. And this is a competitive team. Baseline. McDonald, that's the little jump for Oregon. Joan, you've been in this situation so many times. End of the game situations, execution. Rebounded by McDonald. She's lightning in a bottle. First shot, second. Ten, and then hit four or five from uh, in the fourth quarter, and the Cougs got that win over the dogs. McDonald. She says her mom and dad watch on the Pac-12 network, and... Her mom sometimes offers critiques. They both played back. Thomas to the baseline. McBride kind of trapped there. McDonald from the court. Probably upset with the effort in the first day. Yeah, you could tell with both coaches that they're right in here. One possession game as you go into half. Runs down the pass. Try to get it to Subasic. Reese takes it away. McDonald now chased by Molina. Shot up and good. Airy. Out of Pleskovich, who did not have a lot of luck scoring the other night off the mark and here comes McDonald aggressive I'm not sure if that was a shot or a pass attempt but in any event Arizona comes out with it McDonald accelerates 
and scores. Using her size matchup advantage in that case. And what in the world? So corral that ball. When you're too fast, your teammates. There we go. Too explosive. You can't only defend her with one person. And here she goes. Accelerator. And the foul. And Five seconds on the shot clock. Thomas. Short on the three. Rebound goes to Ari McDonald. Kurt. Pocket is picked by McDonald. She is on the run and gets the finish. McDonald. Good if it goes. Up short. Cats on the move. The dangerous McDonald goes to work. Back to the basket now. Steps back. 13-6 start for the Wildcats. Again, a great crowd on hand. We'll have the exact numbers for you. Doesn't post up until then. My goodness, she's going to take the whole team on right now for UCLA. Harry bobbing, weaving with the English. Runner as well. She ran the four. She ran the 100. She ran the 200. Just like Ma, Edith, who ran at Mizzou and ran at a high level. And there is it. Stute Carter. Played 92 games at Penn State before making her home here. McDonald again. See how she describes her players. Expectations. Unbelievable. On the move, McDonald took it away. All the way to the pocket. And another it was a, another offensive rebound for Anya Nwede and for the Bruins. And a finish there. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Right behind her. Kate Reese says, I got you. McDonald again. McDonald. Killed USC halftime 13. They lost in double overtime by a pair. This one they trailed by 15 and a half from the line. And you know, she, I'm sorry, USC knows she hasn't missed. What she does what has knocked out her first shot from the floor. We know she's capable of going off on two. Arizona history. Caldwell, her first two points, averages seven points in a team high 33 minutes. McDonald. Marina Ionescu, 76 in a row. Kick someone back, and you better watch your first. Towards the end of the second quarter, Arizona on top by six. Inside three minutes remaining here in the third. McDonald through the Smith screen. All the way to the bucket. Go. Well, and you get more opportunities to score, it really helps your team. McDonald for three. And they've been switching up on who is in front of her with this zone. Aggressive drive. Arizona needs to find a way to solve this zone for Oregon. That's one way. Creates some space. Work extremely hard, not only for herself, but in his honor. Yeah, the players on both sides as McDonald's not giving Donald nowhere to go. McDonald up to the Ari left side. McDonald. And here is Ari McDonald. You will enjoy watching her play tonight. Oregon State wearing. Quick and can anticipate where the ball is going to go. She's got it right now. And puts it up from 18 and knocks it down. Where she was honorable mention all Big Ten. Poyo fighting it away from Pivik. Ari McDonald puts it up and in. It's okay. Try to thread that pass too much. Ari McDonald. And one. Oregon State staying in the zone. McDonald putting it up over Tudor and rattles one. McDonald open. Knocks it down. Aliyah Goodman with seven on the timer. Wild shot over her head. Amari Carter the rebound. Her sixth of the game. Jones playing with four fouls for Oregon State. McDonald taking the ball all the way to the rack against Pivot. McBride with the steal. McDonald filling the lane. McDonald the lefty, you bet. Carter with the swipe. Slips it. Five now for Milani. And getting that ball. He talked about the third quarter low, Mayor. And here we go off the pick. McDonald so quick. Remember, she's a lefty. Uh -huh. they have the tattoo that you mentioned. It, 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 just, it just warms your heart. Extra pass by Pueyo. The longest active streak in the nation, though, for McDonald. 61 straight in double figures. And one, baby. Oh, don't let McDonald, so quick. And the finish. My goodness. 15.
Neri with 10 on the shot clock. She's going to take that baseline and score. Exciting player in women's basketball. McDonald out there forcing the issue. McDonald. You betcha. And Thomas has the rebound and she's on the run. McDonald for three. Had to come from behind. Washington State was very tough at home against the Wildcats and Sun Devils. McDonald. Busy tonight with Cal. Cal comes to Tucson to end the weekend. And a chance for three. She doesn't have any turnovers. And she's still playing the way she plays. Like that. You know, there, there she takes. Got a tough, tough game against Colorado. Did they ever? Only 38 points. It's so incredible. During the game, she is the master. And there's Zary McDonald somehow getting that rebound. And through the crowd. I don't think she called bank. McDonald all the way. Gets the Always looking to shoot a bridge, and she did that time. But a second separation, shot clock, game clock. McDonald all the way for the lead! But we'll see if they uh, can pick it up here defensively, and there it is. Erin McDonald, they pick in your pocket. I mean, because she's going against some big players and fearless. And the Cats drop a field goal in there. There it is! Anastasiesco was asking for that basketball along the baseline. McDonald fired it away from the basket. That's what created that mess. McDonald, for the first time. How much would she love to go out a winner? And here she is. McDonald with seven on the shot clock. Drills it. Just not enough playing well as well. Arizona assisting on... So many of their buckets. McDonald shows you why she's the defensive player of the year. It's like a little zipper up action here by Arizona. McDonald takes the pick and gets it home. The switch hands. So Cal drawing ever closer. McDonald splitting the defense, stepping through and scoring. The oh, unlucky. Ball is up for grabs into the arms of Cuello. McDonald. Double figures for the six. Blow by Brown. Pretty good footwork by the senior. Triple. And that is Harry McDonald. They're the team that wants to run. They can't be run back on. McDonald attack. Nobody stepped. Last couple days. Yep. McDonald. Yes. Can... Oh, quick cross in the middle <laughs> and up and go. I think he's been fairly quiet. Three points for her. And it's a good question. The Wildcats have been trying to do it as McDonald gets it. Tries the left hand. Smith on the weak side. Another chance. Oh, McDonald. Pull back. Crossover. And a quick two before half. Adia's like, let's go. McDonald. Right. She's there. They get it. And Kate Reese looks ahead. McDonald, hesitation enough. McDonald looks right, goes left. No field goals in the last 250. And McDonald's going to change that right for Hebert. Leading score this season. McDonald, in tomorrow night, face the winner of our next semifinal matchup between two seed UCLA, three seed Stanford. And ring that one up. Season Sabrina did. So why is she so hard to defend? Because she can have a scoring night like this, or she can have a night where she just lights you up with assists, setting up all these shooters and scores. Yeah. McDonald, it ends up in her hands, and she down to three. Sabali stepped back with a second on it off the front of the rim, no good. A minute remaining here in this one. Quick one from McDonald.